G'day and welcome back to our CK2 run with the lucky Russians. Hopefully you get lucky with this consumption outbreak. Alright, 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 go away. Yep, consumption is starting to shrink. That's a good sign. We haven't had to eat anybody yet either. Uh, he's got a dead bird. We gain kind for a loss of intrigue. We can't afford that. Gain cruel for a gain of intrigue. We can't afford that. And he'll probably get willful. And we didn't get cruel. Damn. Uh, serious look on his face. He gains intrigue. He shall do well. Okay. And, yeah. I think they lose their thing when it's gone. Lose their prosperity. The sun was born. Mitrofan Igor. And the concubine's pregnant. Come on. Hey, they're not even in here with us. Um, he's got nothing going for him. He's going to have to struggle. And we've inherited Ruthenia. He has... He's not our dynasty. Alright, let's go look in. Ruthenia. That's these guys, right? Bolinia is in Ruthenia, yes. Alright, so back to the dynasty view. Can we see any... What are we? We're not Sversky, we're Slavensky. No dynasty. I don't think we've got anything in here at all. No. Hmm. I wonder. We've both got the churches in the top. Alright. Um, it's fine. We'll just give it to the guy. Actually, somebody young. 16 year old. Alright, Chief, we grant you Ruthenia and everything under it. So lower all of your feudal duke and king. Bleh. Fine. Alright, we're still on 20 though. They must have had something else. So, back in the vassals. Chief of Ingria. Ingria is under Russia. Hmm. Alright, well, he's under Estonia, so we should be just able to give it to him. Transfer Chief of Ingria. Puts on 19, so what's the other one? MMA, High Chief. Twer, Rostov, Moscow, Lithuania. Should be under this Vice Royalty. Okay, puts it on 18. I can't remember what we were on before. Alright, uh, Vladimir Saxony is there because we haven't taken out that kingdom. Pushkov, Bluzero, Yaroslav, Moscow, Rostov, Twer. Yeah, we're on 18. Alright, and anybody annoyed? Hang on. The Marshal. We have many powerful vassals. Viceroy of Kamania don't have a non-aggression pact and he's actually the best for the job. What's he Viceroy of? Kamania. Okay. Betrothed may marry. I think this was one that we needed to uh, secure a non-aggression pact. Let's designate our regents. Um, let's look at our powerful vassals. This guy is not the best. Hmm. Alright, uh, yeah, for Maya. And we still have some more vulnerable elders. Go for Roman, Ilgi, and him. Okay. Oh, we're free. Open the gates. Didn't use any food up that time. And still got 
full prosperity. None in the others. All right. Um, 25% chance of being kind is pretty bad. So we want to try and become cruel. It still fail. And he loses in trade. Unfortunate. And we're 18 out of 16. What else do we lose that from? Diplomacy bonus is 6. Should be fine. High Chief of Bluesaro. Bluesaro is next to us, right? Moscow. Pushkov is in ours. Yeah. Hang on. Pomeranian Holy War for Brunswick on Saxony. No, I think I read that wrong. Okay. As I retired my chambers, I was shocked to find a copy of the Catholic Bible. Go to hell. Give us paranoid. And yeah, what do we need? We need a thousand. Alright. Let us trust her. Um, we need to try to recruit somebody. Master plot to kill her. Um, sure. Shall we try to bring in <coughs> this guy? Actually, it's somebody that should work with would be Shia, right? Yeah, Shia on our borders over here. How did that become Taoist? It's not ours. Um, you, buddy. Recruit to the assassins. <coughs> and she died during childbirth. Alright, um... Let's Let's go find... Somebody new. Uh, is there anybody lusty and busty? 18 year old. Take your concubine. Yes. Attraction Alright, invite him to join the assassins. Disappointing. Alright, we'll try somebody else along there. Alright, so we've got 18 year old, 20 year old, and 28 year old. My wife is 37, so we'll be able to pop some out. Now, where is she? Lower Volga. No idea if she's already finished, let's just throw her there. That is. Tritiza. So tell us about Franconia. Alright, so we've got a little bit of cash. I think we want to keep building up the hospital. Uh, so, the observatory, separated wards three, I assume that's the next one after this. It is. That's a lot of gold. Let's just save up for that. Oh, actually, because our thing is a uh, thousand ducats anyway. Let's go past that. <clears throat> hmm. Alright, and we'll keep an eye out. Four epidemics. I think that would take you to the centers. Alright, and it's probably about time for another holy war too. Mm -hmm. Alright, Yuri Evan Husi. Which ones do we not have? Oh, we lost that one. From Kiev. Okay. Fill their hearts with dread. What are you? Hindu. Backing this other one. Is, um, <laughs> she's in with us anyway. His days are numbered. What do we want? Alright, this should give us the, enough. Hopefully. Failure, damn it. Except, uh, alright. What do you want? Hold Jarillo, yes. And when's the next book? Uh, 58, long time. Uh, 
courtier died. Okay. As the celebration winds down, we go drinking together. There's always one lunatic at the party. Foul it again. Uh, should we allow a jewel? Why would we... I don't know. Alright. Gain grace with the Zhao. Or... What proud give us prestige? Don't care about that. Uh, yeah, take the 150. Classic. Poisoned wine. Alright, precision party. Um, there's another bit. Alright, what do you want? Slandering you. Threaten him with exposure unless he stays out of factions. Excellent. And the only thing keeping him above us is that he's the only propagandist. Success. Alright, mission done. Shouldn't we have got some points for that? Hmm. Alright. Uh, Commander continues to improve up to a 20. Light foot combat. Excellent. And how are we doing in China? Alright, let's go ask for an artifact. Truly a magnificent man. We get the history of Zhao. Don't mind having books. History. And what kind of order they put these in? History of Zhao. Book detailing the lives of the emperors is one of the great dynasties of China. Not a very exciting read, but it does inspire thoughts of having a dynasty as grand as theirs. Quality one. And it gives uh, fertility. Good enough. You have to have six learning to be able to read it. And yeah, we're really going to boost them. All right, betrothal. I think you'll find that they should not. She should be matrilineally marrying somebody young enough. Uh, Thirty-three-year-old sounds fine. Alright, Mycin's converted. How is... Yeah, most of Germany's gone. Bits and pieces. What do we have here? I'm pretty sure things said Brunswick. Might have been Bremen. Well, I guess we could find out. Um... Scotland, so in Swedish claim on Scotland. Krillian, Holy War for Cola. Okay. Uh, Ingeberg, you remember to cry. Spend an evening drunk. No. Put an end to your suffering. No. Distance yourself from all your friends. Uh, if we lose that hundred, we should still be okay. Yeah, 84. Good enough. And we've built our war chest. Alright. We actually get another choice. Groom and heir. Good timing. He is 12. Alright, for dot. You have to keep checking for diseases out there now. Two in this guy's lifetime. And this was up to 19 before. Midas touched minus one. Really? We are dull. And this commander was already pretty good. Now he's very good. A lot of narrow flank. Alright, nothing to be done there. And we've inherited Volga Bulgaria. He did not have children. Damn it. He had a young wife. His siblings died of cancer. Died on the toilet. Died of pneumonia. Died of a heart attack. Died of a heart attack. Died of a heart attack. And died of food poisoning. That family. King Renault, the sword of Radagast. Yeah, not a very lucky family. Two went off to China. The rest are dead. This one's still alive. She's betrothed regularly. That whole side of the family has been wiped out. Did 
Jesus. Here's that whole edge of the family tree. Okay. Well, we have to give Volga Bulgaria to somebody. And I can't even remember where it is. It's this middle bit. Okay. Um, where are we? Why not let me do it? There. There are Slavenskis down here. Good. Um, pick the younger. Grant the vice royalty of Volga Bulgaria. Go. And there was something else there. Alright, let's go find... What do we have? Uh, Chief of Bashkiria. Chief of Mr. Slav. Alright, he should be under... Ruthenia. Transfer vassalage of... Oh, we can have this high priest. Um... Seriously, not there. Okay. Should be under this guy. Transfer vassalage is not there. Really, don't understand how that works. All right. High Chief Saxony, Pushkov, Luzero, Moscow, leader of Yaroslavian Revolt, High Chief Turkestan. He should be under the Sultan of Turkestan that doesn't exist yet, so that's why that happened. Alright, um, this one. Transfer vassalage of... Yeah, so we're not allowed. Hmm. We have to give him to the other king. Where's Perm? No, can't get rid of it. It's going to be stuck on 20. Actually, was there another one? Chief of Bashkiria, Mr. Slav, Yaroslav Altwer, Yike. Yike should be under Kamania. I don't get why we can't transfer vassalage. Alright, and somebody's gone and taken this, so we have to spend money on this instead. Let's go build that castle before we do the. whatever we're doing in the hospital. Hey, there we go. Alright, definitely level up straight away. Because this guy's old. Old as old can be. Come on. And are they welcome? Yes, they are. Give us a hundred. Promoted to propagandist. There we go. So now we're the heir. And this dude is super old. We can't kill him, but he's awesome. Alright, what do you want? You should get betrothed. We decline. She's 25. She needs to marry... Uh, this guy. After two of Novgorod, we get another 200 grace. 387. So we can't do anything there. When was this? Uh, it's 50 now, so it's 58. 58 and 51. Send another commander soon. Chen Xing Zhao. Alright, they're stable and he's young. Good. Denmark and Spithyod. Krillian Holy Wharf Cola. Okay. Third Finnish Holy Wharf Cola as well. Everyone wants peace. Cola is, um. What? Three. Fair enough. Hope they win. Frankia came in because it's a holy war. So they're going to lose it. 82% in favour of Svithyod. Yep. Many years of my life being spent dedicated to the assassins. He's died. How was that for timing? Got it like a month or two in time. And now we are Grandmaster. So, who do we need to kill first? How much power do we have? Okay. I'm surprised we actually got it back. And only in our 40s. Lombardy.
Africa, Andalusia, and Lombardy. All the same air. Damn it. You're not having children. He has no children. Count of Telatlas, 21. She's 21. All right, we'll give her know, a decade to pop out some kids so that they can split this up between them. I assume they were still gavel kind. Yep. AC gavel kind in all three. Good. So, who do we want to kill? Let's have a look at Frankie's deal. He has just two duchies. Um, what about the kingdoms? Kingdom of England, Burgundy, and Ireland. They're probably all... Um, no, they go all kind as well. He gets two. This guy's not old enough. Not young enough, I mean, to have a third kid. No, so we might as well kill him now. Alright, give it a go. Um, it'll also be under Frankia anyway, so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> kill him during a drunken stupor. Occupied by Norjar. Where is Norway? I see Denmark, I see Sweden. Denmark's actually surprisingly big now. Dirty secret. Expose it. Plot revealed. Crusade for Syria. Crusade. Not a holy war for us. It is no concern of ours. Not doing well in this war is a bit of a concern for ours. In favour of Svithyod. Yep, about to lose that one. And the Menion. Holy war for Tyrol. Excuse me. Svithyod down here. That's interesting. Gain a little bit of gold. Alright, so we got the thousand. What exactly did we need? It? Nah. It was about 1100. 1138. Found myself worrying about my little daughter. Nope. Uh, good point. Shouldn't we be doing the thing with our heir soon? Or is that not for us? I can't remember when the um, thing actually comes out. Uh, use it in moderation. Stewardship. Alright, must have walked past for hundreds of times. My friends. There we go. Uplifting vision. It's only for a year, but helps out with everything. Oh, crap. What happened to the vassals? When did we get Pomerania? Alright, whatever. Oh, built a paper mill. Cool. Um, Brandenburg's not one of ours. No, show me dynasties. Slavensky's over here, except it's not. Hmm. All right, so we have nothing in here. Then who should we give it to? Do have this one, but that's Poland. All right, Pomerania, yeah, ends there. Holtmark and Meissen, no. Oh, okay. Cousin, he's young enough. Current vice royalty of Pomerania with all under it. Twenty-one. So there's still something wrong there. So it might be this one. And Chief of Mr. Slav. Mr. Slavel and Pushkov. Right, well, Mr. Slavel is under uh, Smolensk. Transfer Vassalage. I mean, it's probably the reason we can't do it is because he's under the other one as well. Not you, the other guy. Um, Pushkov is under Pushkov. Can we transfer it to him? No. Alright. 
Seduction in the wild must protect Marla from such dangerous people. This is our daughter. She's rowdy. Go that way. Alright, according to the Chancellor, the peasants have started a delightful tradition. Prosperity in Parapets. And we've nearly got the money now. Number 28. Oh, like the sea devil. Alright, a dirty secret. Flesh is weak. There we go. Expanded sick house. Most expensive thing I've ever built in this game. And she can have thrift. Alright, seduction in the wild. Yeah, go away. Great holy war for Pannonia. This is what we want to see. Um, Pannonia is not huge though, is it? Let's go to our holy war. Um, Pannonia. Seriously. Uh, who did you declare this on? From the Basilius. Okay. So that's for this bit. So worried it's just going to be for that one in Lombardy. Kingdom of Pannonia. We're going to grab just this stuff around here. What is this? Oh, the Grandmaster. I forgot they exist. All right. Oh, we get everything on this side of these at the Carpathians. Um, no, the Carpathians are... No, that's the... All right, Caucasus. Whatever. Um, well, we're obviously going to do this. So... We have no real problems back home, I imagine. Our nephew. Can't get a thing with him. Alright. Um, yeah, we'll raise the lot. And this is going to be a little expensive. But have that cranked up. And where are they going to rally? They are going to go to Göttingen as well. There's some Blackingans. Gonna beat us, hopefully we don't lose too many. Okay. And is he going yeah, he's still going to Gottingen. Alright. Invite the plot. You wanna kill our courtier? Sure. We'll uh, join in anything killy. Alright, and he's in revolt. I was just gonna see if we should go and assassinate him to weaken him a bit. What's his deal? At 16k. Basilius Theodorus the Holy. His heir. He's 14. He's about to come of age. He's got a little prestige. Um, yeah, we'll go and assassinate him afterwards. What is the... Revolt about, though? It's a claim on the Byzantine Empire. So, no, we don't want to kill him. We need that to drag out. Okay. Keep an eye on the armies, keep an eye on supply down around here, as long as there's no diseases or anything. What's wrong with these ones? Normal winter. Okay, well, by the time we're ready, winter will be over. It's all good. And it should just be him. There's a Kagan who's orthodox. Over there, okay. We could do a holy war on him at the same time if we hadn't raised our troops. Or if we had declared that first and then joined in. Don't know. Bandits. Alright, so that's the end of them. Uh, we're going to pull them out this side. Oh, look at all the um, level 3s. That's awesome. How much are we getting here? 31. Yeah, okay. Let's just quickly go over there. Hmm. Alright, jumped in and killed them all. Get out of there quickly. You have to split this army in half. And... Chance of becoming patient. Come on, get out of there. Peasant Revolt has it. Oh, did we have that going on for a while? I do remember having that. Just don't look down there very often when I don't think we're at war. Alright, uh, there are two armies. So, split these guys up. It's always terrible supply there, so let's go this way. Uh, 
Oh, it should be okay. Alright, once you're there, come down this general direction. That's actually faster. Okay. And we need a regent. He looks good. Do we still have our uh, court tutor? No. The steward of Russia can be the tutor. And we have space for another venerated elder. Go for Rurik. Alright, everybody's mostly pretty happy here. Shall we try and recruit somebody? Hang on. I already know that he's secretly Shia. Cool. Good start. Now, uh, Byzantium. Yeah, there's 19,000. We're raising... Uh, what? 17, 19, 20, 21,000 just by ourselves. And then we've got a lot more of our guys coming in. Range patrol. Sounds good. That's with a bit of inbreeding. Alright, just about to draft an invitation. I think the time has come to invite him to join the assassins. End the attempt. Nah. So how big is our dynasty? Let me look at that number. 102 living members. And yes, after Wen Shinu, who was just an incredible dynasty leader. Well, some of these are having babies now as well. Oh. Um, yes, send more troops. She went to China and had some babies. Turn off that side. Yeah. Hell of a lot of descendants of the good emperor when she knew the cleansing frame. Cleansing flame of Russia. The one that died of severe stress at 58. That was way too soon. Alright. They are nearly there. Got more forming up. Oh, they're the ones that come from the Far East. Have succumbed to starvation. Alright, wearing reports of victory regarding your marshal. It's been extorting money. Revolt risk in Novgorod. Deal with him later. Um, we're going to have to put him to suppress revolts in Novgorod. Not dealing with that. And head up here before we come back. Guess we can just keep them up there to take care of that. Alright, so supply limits around here should be plentiful. Let's go to Kiev, Premishol, and Sandomir's. And he's the only one that has anything on him. One, two, three, four, five, six. Right, well, first thing. We need to check through. If any of these are completely useless. Nikita. It's a trickster. Hmm. Um, tough soldier, school tactician. What's that one? Yep. Yeah, none of these are very good. Amount of troops, but morale defense down because he's craven. No, I thought we've got the best ones in there already. So, what do they have? Ingild has narrow flank. We've got movement speed on Slavomir. Narrow flank there. Alright, well. I don't think we're going to be able to do much. We're going to have to have one that does the fights and the others that, I don't know, just try and pick up a bit of slack. There's no siege modifiers here anymore. Hmm. Alright. Oh, and we don't need the Intrigue focus anymore. We really need a Diplo focus. Um, carousing or family? We want to live forever. We'll go family. And we're that update. That was not enough. Damn it.
All right, they get in there to protect their prosperity. Good. Um, could head over there and do them. Just go and scare them off. All right, threaten the vessel. All right, do we have... Oh, nearly. Um, it's going to get the siege engineers. They cost 500. They got 750. All right. Um, so where are we getting close to? Send a eunuch. No, it's the... Send the other guys. Can't do it when he's stable. All right. And the separated wards have been built. Um, are we in the top? No. Viceroy Slavomir get everything at the moment. We're already at 20%. We're going to have to look for a battle to do, I think. Hopefully not. So, that's built. Let's go have a look at our hospital. We've got 235 ducats. So we've got separated wards. The observatory also needs pharmacology lab. This one, which just needs gold. Alright, so, well, separated wards is uh, the thing for most of it. Thing you usurped a hell of a lot. Um, technology spread rate is the thing for that. Alright, and with all of our armies being paid, I'm thinking 10 per month. Okay, uh, did we scare them off? Partially. And Svithjord's gone. It's all under Denmark. It's all. Trying to kill the king of Burgundy and Ireland. Okay, okay, okay. Two, th all right, forty-nine versus thirty-eight. That's the one number we need to keep an eye on. Raise an army of assassins. That we shall do. Get this five thousand. To do a headlong rush to his capital. No, nah, there'll be people on the way there. Um, this area here is inside what we're supposed to be grabbing. Let's go to Abalj. Victory, Yaroslav, and Kiev. And where's this disease? Smallpox in Mecklenburg, down there. All right, 45 versus 42. And now we're in front. Good, and it's already over 50%. Victory, victory. So Kiev tribe. Uh, still going on these. Alright, that's done. Let's get to Sax. And what was the other one there? Oh, it's another one of the Warriors of Purim. Oh, because it's the holy site. Fair enough. Go down to Terraboval. Kill a couple of guys. Mastermind Theologian. Massive learning boost. That is awesome. Alright, buddy. We've groomed our heir. Um, firstly, he needs to be recruited to the assassins. Secondly, what can we do with him? Want a grand landed title. Uh, we'll do that. Once we take all this, we'll make him the guy. And Jarem goes to this guy. Alright, the rest of that is our home stuff. Seven. Okay. Unlanded son, but not for long. You should get married. Good point. That's why we needed this. So the Imperial marriage takes a thousand. He has to wait. I like being able to raise those troops. Continue in our attempts. Alright, he needs to become an assassin. With his dad as the Grand Master. Like, come on. Ask the question. Someone will get in touch shortly. <laughs> awesome. Usually fails. Like, it failed with us and then we joined afterwards anyway. And then we came out and then we went back in again. Alright, he is 12. He is fussy and playful. Perfect for intrigue. Unfortunately, 
he's going to be a rival for our uh, heir. All right, how are we doing here? They are still on the way through. They've beaten us there. Let's go around to this one. It's not going to take very long. I don't think there's been a signal of battle yet. All right, and Sandemese is done. So get over to Krakor. And we've got it. Okay, that was a big jump at the end there. Successful Great Holy War 4. Triglov has granted Emperor Deadmeat of Russia victory in the Great Holy War for Pannonia against Basilius Cyrodorus of the Byzantines. High Priest Erzia has called for a month's celebration across the whole pagan world. Praise Triglov. Successful Crusade for Syria. Wow, he was copping up from both ends. Because Byzantium has got that whole thing down there. And... Somebody there as well. Alright, um... Yeah, it only gave us this little bit here. But, plenty of stuff to hand off to our heir. Which I'll do during the break. So, thanks for watching. Hope you're enjoying it. Let me know what you think in the comments. And hope to see you again soon. See you later.